Cleveland police say a father was shot and killed earlier this morning in a rather quiet part of town. Good evening, I'm Calvin Snead. And I'm Latricia Thomas. It happened at a home on Sunset Avenue. That's where we find News Channel 9's Hannah Lawrence. Hannah, do we know yet who's responsible? 6 a.m. this morning and uh, they just left the scene about 30 minutes ago and took down the crime scene tape. Police say that no one was arrested, but they know who fired the gun. James Michael Cheatham dead. Police say his wife pulled the trigger. Officers confirmed these are pictures of the couple posted on Miranda Cheatham's public Facebook page. We're looking at it as a domestic related fatal shooting. According to police, Mrs. Cheatham not only fired the gun, but also called 911. They found a male laying on the floor. Neighbors say this is certainly not what they usually find on their street on a Monday morning. When we woke up, we came to the front door here and we just saw all these lights flashing down there and we thought, well, what is going on? Bobby Jean Clayton didn't know the couple, but says she's never seen anything like this in the 27 years she's lived here. We've never had any problem at all up and down through here. It's been really quiet. CPD officers say the Cheatham's teenage son was also home when the shooting happened. Mr. Cheatham was pronounced dead at the hospital, which police say complicates their investigation. We only have one side of the story, which is hers. Um, we can't get his side. Um, so we have to listen what she has to say and then make sure that matches up with the evidence presented. According to the Better Business Bureau website, Cheatham ran a roofing business out of his home. A few people have showed up here and said that they worked for him and that he was a good man. Some family was outside earlier today and they said that they did not wish to comment or be on camera. For now, live in Cleveland, Hannah Lawrence, News Channel 9. Thanks, Hannah. News Channel 9 requested the 911 call Miranda Cheatham made this morning. Police say it is not being released at